Hi, it's my time to shine. I'm about to do the Virgo reading from May the 1st to May the 30th. Had to walk away and get my cantaloupe smoothie. Sorry. But take what resonates and leave the rest. Don't make something you when it's not. My cars is pretty shuffled, but I will always shuffle them near the camera three times. I hope everybody's healthy. And making sure everything is fine. I got some good things that's going on in my life. I can't even talk about. I'm not allowed. I'm just going to keep the blessings coming. And thank God for everybody that he brings my way. That's it. Okay, without any further delay, we're going to see your overall energy. The overall energy is the Nine of Swords. You may feel bound up, blind, can't see the situation clearly for what it is. That's your overall energy. Universe, Spirit Guide, Holy Angels. Please tell the Virgos what they need to do for 2020. Universe, spirit, guys, holy angels, please tell the Virgos what they need to know for 2020. What do they have to look forward to? What do they need to know? Please tell the Virgos what they need to know for 2020. Universe, spirit, guides, holy angels. Please tell the Virgos what they need to know. Excuse me. Please tell the Virgos what they need to know for 2020. Okay. Okay. Please tell the Virgos what they need to know. Okay, for 2020, Universe, Spirit Guide, Holy Angels, Archangel Michael, please tell the Virgos what they need to know for 2020. What do the Virgos need to know for 2020? The first card you have is judgment. You have the six of wands, which is victory. And you have the three of swords, which is a painful situation, lies, betrayal, third party situation. This is your past position. Judgment basically is asking for forgiveness. You also got the king of pentacles, which is Capricorn energy. For your present, you got the Page of Pentacles, which is somebody you want to offer you some type of pinnacle. This is the Capricorn energy. You have the Empress, which I say is a Capricorn Libra energy for your present. For your future, you have the Nine of Swords, anxiety, can't sleep, maybe nightmares. You have the Four of Wands, which is joining of two families in a marriage or some type of gathering. Gathering, sorry. You have the Nine of Cups, basically represents Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, could be significant. And this also could mean your emotions all in check, or you could be just in this type of um, energy as, as, you know, as now. 
I'm going to finish a reading and use my other order, Oracle card. Well, not Oracle. My um basic tarot to just do an overall clarifier. Universe, spirit guides, holy angels, please clarify the judgment card. Why is the judgment card here for my Virgos? Why is the judgment card here for my Virgos? Whoop, try to fall too. You got the death card. It's an ending to something completely. Please clarify the death card. Why is the death card here? Wow. You got the sun reverse, which is things is all in uphill, and you got the hair fought reverse. This is somebody with bull energy. You could be dealing with a Taurus, which is an earth sign, and this is somebody that lacks authority, lacks um, any respect for anybody that's higher than them. I'm going to clarify. Wow. I was about to clarify the sun reversed, and it came out that you got confusion around you. Which Virgos usually do. And then you got the two of pentacles for verse where you trying to stay balanced in this situation and you really can't. I'm going to clarify this six of wands. Universe, spirit guide, holy angels. You got the empress reverse, which is not a good card. Where the empress is reverse. It speaks of a nasty, a nasty type of nature. Overindulged, overindulged enjoy, enjoyment of sensational pleasure, a tendency to become dominating and just being very mean. That's what you have. I'm going to clarify this third party situation that you in, and maybe you don't even know it. Universe, spirit guide, holy angels, please clarify the three of swords. You got the four of rods. This is a joining of two families in a situation. So bear it with this. Maybe that you in a third party situation with somebody that's married. I'm going to clarify the king of pentacles for your present energy, which is your money. Universe, spirit guides. Okay. Too many cards coming out. Too many cards coming out. I want to reshuffle. Okay, one come out. Great. You got the four of cups reverse, which everything is spilled out. You got something on your mind. You could be dealing with a Cancer Scorpio Pisces, but you don't see the universe trying to hand you another cup. Universe, fair guy, holy angels, please clarify the four of cups. Why is the four of cups here for the Virgos? What do the Virgos need to know? Why is the four of cups here? Why is the four of cups here? Wow. You got the ace of pentacles reverse. You got the high priestess reverse. And then you got the ten of cups upright. It's got some family issues going on. And then you got the high priestess reverse. I'm going to tell you what the high priestess is reverse. Because I forgot. I don't really get them type of cards reverse. The high priestess, you got reverse. Suggests vanity and stability is selfishness and deception, which a lot of Virgos I do know knew that. Not all, but they deceptions, they be starting trouble and they just be lying in deception. So that's what you got for your present energy with the Ten of Cups reverse, which means it's family squabbles, is nothing really major. I'm going to clarify the Page of Pentacles. Universe, spirit guide, holy angels, please clarify the page of pentacles. Okay, all these cards came out, but mm -mm. universe, spirit guide, holy angel, please clarify the page of pentacles. One card, please. The page of pentacles. Why is the page of pentacles here for my Virgo? Wow. You got your sign, the hermit. You have to go within and pray about a situation, and bad luck is on your side. I don't know what's going on. I'm going to clarify that. Will the fortune reverse? Universe, spirit guy, holy angels, please clarify the will of fortune. Why is the will of fortune reversed? 
Please clarify the will of fortune for my Virgos, please. Why is the will of fortune reversed? What do they need to know? You got the Queen of Rods reversed also. You are jealous when crossed and fickle in your affections. You cannot be persuaded. So maybe somebody trying to persuade you in something. I'm going to clarify that Queen of Rods. Universe, Spirit, Guy, Holy Angels, please clarify the Queen of Rods. Why is the Queen of Rods here from my Virgos? What do they need to know? Why is the Queen of Rods here from my Virgos? One card, please. Too many. Yeah. Hmm. Please clarify the Queen of Rods. Why is the Queen of Rods here from my Virgos? What do they need to know? What do the Virgos need to know? You got the Moon reverse. You got the Five of Pentacles reverse. Somebody left you out in the cold, or you left somebody out in the cold, and then you got the Three of Pentacles reverse, which is all your energy. We're gonna see why your Moon is reverse. Deceptions are unmasked. Small mistakes can be corrected. So they, whatever you're doing or whatever sneaky stuff that you're doing, people see through it. And then somebody feels though they left you out on the cold or you left somebody out on the cold with the three of pentacles. Sloppy work or inattention to detail. You could do better. Like you being sloppy in something that you're doing. I'm going to clarify this Empress, which is the Capricorn energy. Universe, Spirit, Guide, Holy Angels, please clarify the Empress. For my Virgos, why is the Empress here? Why is the Empress here? Please clarify the Empress. Holy Angels, one card please, Universe, Spirit Guide, Holy Angels, please clarify the imprints. Why is the imprints here for my Virgos? Why is the imprints here? Two cards came out, which is the Nine of Swords, Anxiety, Nightmares, Depression, Nine of Cups. So maybe somebody's in the empress position, but they depressed about a situation. It could be they could be dealing with a cancer, Scorpio, or a Pisces. I'm going to find out. Surrounded by golden cups, a man beams happily. The peacock feather in his hat and that good luck, the wish card, promises that a wish probably of a material nature will be granted. So something you wish for is going to be granted. Maybe you wish to get out of this depression state or whatever situation got you in this depression state. I'm going to clarify the nine of swords in your future, whereas though you under straight agony. Universe, spirit guide, holy angels. Okay. You got the six uh pinnacles you're trying to balance out a situation or that could be a third party energy universe spirit guide holy angel please clarify the six of pinnacles why is the six of pinnacles there for my virgos wow okay that flipped out too you have the nine of wands this could be somebody that's incarcerated a wounded warrior that can't do nothing can't go nowhere they only got to make one thing happen when one wand could be a third party maybe you stressed out about this wounded warrior and you trying to stay balanced in that situation because the lover's card came out so it's a decision you maybe have to make about this wounded warrior that could be incarcerated or in some type of institution and you trying to balance out and you got to make a clear judgment and you have a choice to make within a lover or just a choice in general that's what i'm getting so i'm gonna clarify that lovers 
universe, spirit guide. Or this also could be you feeling like this is how you feel, like you a wound, you wounded warrior. Universe, spirit guide, holy angels, please clarify the lovers. Why are the lovers here? You got the nine of rods. This is a slow moving energy. Somebody want to make something happen. An Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Please clarify the nine of rods. Wow. This is the chariot. This is somebody moving in fast in a situation. Universe, spirit, guide, holy angels. Please clarify the chariot. Why is the chariot here? This is somebody that's a quick thinker. This also indicates trouble with the police. And this also indicates spying. Maybe some truth in the matters coming out about somebody that's spying on you and something's coming out to do with the police. I'm going to clarify the page of swords. Universe, spirit, guides, holy angels. I didn't even, okay. Please clarify the page of swords. Why is the page of swords here for my Virgos? What do the Virgos need to know? Holy spirit, angel guides. You got the Ace of Rods reverse, and usually it's a good card, but you got the Ace of Rods reverse, so I might have to see because I don't get them cards reversed. Although there's energy, the goal is to define efforts or wasted. Don't be surprised if whatever plans you got is not going to work. We're going to clarify this Four of Wands, which is joining the two families, a party, a victory. Universe, Spirit, Guide, Holy Angels, please clarify the Four of Wands. Why is the four of wands here? Why is the four of wands here? Why is the four of wands here? You got the ace of cups. Reverse. Clarify with the tower. Basically saying you got to start from the bottom and work your way back up. Please clarify the tower. Why is the tower here? Reverse. You got to start from the rut and build back up. Why is the tower here? Reverse. From my Virgos. There's a lot of confusion around you. That's choices also. Please clarify the seven of cups. Why is the seven of cups here? For my Virgos. You got the six of cups reverse. That this basically says that the um, future is coming quicker than you think. Please clarify the six of cups reverse for my Virgos. Why the Six of Cups? You got a third-party energy, painful, um, heartbreak, betrayal lies. So maybe somebody from your future was in a third-party situation or you had somebody in a party third-party situation. Universe, Spirit, Guy, Holy Angels, please clarify the Three of Swords. Why is the Three of Swords here from my Virgos? What do they need to know? Why is the Three of Swords here? You got the Queen of Pentacles reverse. Somebody spending money or things that's not important. Clarify by the Knight of Swords reverse. Somebody coming, cutting through some bullshit with the truth. Universe, Spirit Guides, clarify. The, King, the Knight of Swords, I got the King of Swords reverse. That's somebody that's mean in nature. Come through rude. Universe, spirit, God. Then you got the devil reverse. They say these addictions can be overcome. You got some addictions issues. Universe, spirit, God. Holy angels, please clarify the devil. Why is the devil here reverse? What do the Virgo need to know? Why is the devil here? Too many cards. One card, universe. Why is the devil here for my Virgos? What do they need to know? Okay. Eight of rods is something coming to you fast. Rods is speed. Message, text message, email, phone calls. Some truth of the matter. Cutting through the bullshit. Getting to the truth. Please clarify the queen of swords. Why is the queen of swords here for my Virgos? Wow, two trying to come out. You got the two of, pen, two of rods waiting for your ships to come in. You got the whole world in your hands, you see. Clarified by a victory. Six of wands. Last but not least, nine of cups, your emotions. 
Please clarify why the Nine of Cups is here for my Virgos. What do my Virgos need to know? You got the King of Pentacles reversed. That's somebody that's ruthless and stingy with their money. Universe, Spirit Guide, Holy Angels. Please clarify. You got the Eight of Cups. Your most is in check. You moving forward, leaving the past all the way behind. You going all the way up to the mountaintop. This is Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. You could be dealing with or you could be in their energy. Clarified by the Page of Pentacles, which is your energy. Somebody want to offer you a pinnacle. Maybe somebody young at heart, a new beginning. And then you got the Eight of Pentacles. All you focusing on is building your pinnacles up and moving forward. This is the Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo energy. So, with that, I'm going to end your reading, and I'm going to see what the universe may have to say about your reading. It looked like you got a lot going on. Universe, one card, it says, clear your space, Virgo. Get rid of clutter. Clear the energy around you. Use Fu Shung. You got a lot of negative energy around you, and it says it's time for you to clear that energy, bottom line. And you do, because your reading was wild. Universe, spirit guide, holy angels. Is there anything that you need to tell the Virgos? One came out. You got too much pride. And a lot of them do. You can't have too much pride in the universe. So, the universe, they say you got too much pride. You got to calm that down. And I'm going to see what a love oracle could be for you. Universe, spirit, guys. Okay. First card that came out. Very soon. Clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you now. You got to figure out what you want in your love life. It says very soon you're going to have to make that decision. The other one says free yourself. It's time to take back control of your life. You see how basic you see like he can't get out. He can't get out of that hole he in or in that circle he just don't want. So it's time for you to free yourself. And then you're going to have to make a decision very soon about somebody or what you want in your life. So that's coming up real soon. So you got to figure all that shit out. So with any other things, I don't know. But y'all have a lot of confusion in your readings. It's like a lot of anxiety and like a confusion, third party situations. Um, Y'all focusing on your pinnacles. You're trying, but you got all this family life going on and just a lot to do with maybe somebody that you could be married to. That maybe be is incarcerated. You got to figure out what you want to do very soon. It's it's a lot going on. So I wish you the best. Peace, light, and blessings.